Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we are going to be playing Hypixel Skyblock once again. So in the last episode, we got extremely powerful. We got ourselves the Void Sword, which it doesn't have as many enchants as the Super Cleaver. So like, I'm probably going to have to work on that, like in all the enchants I need. But like, I didn't do it yet. But like, yeah, we also got ourselves a pair of Ender Armor in our wardrobe. So, like, there's that setup. It's, like, not good here, but if I were to go into the end, now I have 1,200 health and 600 defense. And if I swap to my Void Sword here, I can do kind of a lot of damage, you know? I only It says I only do 8k. I know I said I did 10k last time, but that's because my potion effects ran out. And, yes, there's something different with the island. So, like, I added, like, more minions. Like, I only had 13 minion slots, but now I have 15. Because I collected the upgrade, which is minion slots 3, and then I also crafted more minions, so... I also have a skeleton minion right here, and then a spider minion right here. And now they are working pretty hard, I'd say. also gave, like, the minions that kept filling up quickly, I just gave them budget hoppers. So that, like, if they were to, like, get too full, then, like, they would just start generating money. That could be useful. Oh yeah, I also forgot to mention, while I was like off camera trying to get like some more minion slots, I accidentally got myself a green jerry box and a golden jerry box. And the golden jerry box I can sell for like crazy profit. We could go ahead and collect for my coal and iron minions though. We uh, just unlocked the personal deleter 4000. And that requires an enchanted lava bucket. Like, I might have the iron, but I don't think I have the coal for the enchanted lava. I hope this is enough leather to- There we go, we finally unlocked the enchanted leather. Which requires 5,000 leather collection. Basically, you need 9 stacks of leather. And then you can make the enchanted leather. Like, just one, though. Not even two. It went into my stash somehow. Yeah. So, after all of that, I ended up getting 8 enchanted leather, which is... Not bad, to be honest. You know, one of the enchanted leathers. I think it's just one. I don't think I need two. We can just make ourselves a small mining sack, and then we can upgrade to medium if we want to. And we might as well, right? So now we have a sack in our inventory, and that's going to be really nice. Yeah, we are getting my Enderman pet up to level. I know I could use a bee pet for combat, but I prefer to use the Enderman because of the teleport savvy ability. We don't have an aspect to the end yet, but when we do get one, that ability is going to be really useful. And we're going to use it to our advantage, right? We're going to go over here to the Thought Thaumaturgist. And we unlock some more powers because we got Combat 15 last episode. So we got, like, Commando, Disciplined. And, yeah, right now I'm using Warrior. I, I do like Commando, though. There's Ominous, which also gives attack speed. I don't think we're at the point where we need attack speed yet, though. So I'm probably going to just go with Commando. I have a better idea, though. So, like, instead of, like, selling it now... I could wait, and then, like, wait for the, like, wait for Jerry to not be mayor anymore, and then sell it. Okay, that might be a little too expensive for us right now. For, like, 20 minutes, I don't think that's worth it. So we are selling, f um, five for 60k each, so, like, we could actually do that if we wanted to. Let's actually go ahead and buy those, because that could be really useful. I don't know if you can actually eat multiple at once. Okay, you can only eat one at once. But, like, that can be really useful for us. We can, like, run around and deal more damage. So, I go back to the island because I do want to get Feather Falling on my boots. I'm going to go over Feather Falling 5 for now because, like, sometimes we're going to be falling down the end. And, like, I don't want to die from it. At least I didn't insta-die. So, yeah, there it goes. So now, I have Strength 5. Alright, so we have unlocked the Dragon's Nest now. So, here's where you find Zelots. And then you start killing them. And I immediately got an Epic Jerry. <laughs> Not epic. Oh, purple. Oh yeah, I also killed an obsidian defender. And he gave me the wither effect. That kind of stings a little bit. Yeah, we can't one-tap these creatures down there yet. We only do 9k. I don't know what happened to us doing 10k, but like, we used to deal 10k. Alright, so I decided let's go back to the hub because... Our damage clearly isn't enough. Like, we're only dealing- we're dealing less damage, if anything. I think maybe it's best to, like, keep it on Warrior, because that does keep our strength and crit damage more balanced. But yeah, I have my accessories tuned for speed right now. 
we're gonna like keep up in the that speed, but we have two two point one mil still, so we're gonna get some more talismans. All right, so I'm down to one point four million coins because I bought some talismans. So we're gonna go ahead and put these in our accessory bag. And we're going to get a crap ton of Skyblock XP. So yeah, there you go. We got Skyblock level 25. And I got another talisman called the Book of Progression. So I can select a modifier. And it can make me stronger. So like there's Stacked Healing, which is the one I have unlocked. Defensive Strongman, which is a level 50. And Extra Infliction, which is level 75. We're going to have to get pick bringing some of our coins out just so we can select the Stacked Healing. So yeah, there you go. Now we paid 12k. We're going to put the Book of Progression in there, and that's another Talisman. So yeah, our Talisman bag is pretty much jam-packed, though. We only have four slots left. I think we are pretty much ready to, like, go back to the end and then see our damage now. So yeah, I have 320% speed. I think Mayor Jerry's making us, like, move a little bit faster. My damage is 10k now. That really isn't that bad, you know? We are definitely getting stronger. Yeah, I'm going to go back inside here because we're going to mine some more ender nodes until we get an ender gauntlet. So this might take a while or I might get it instantly. But I don't know. I just got a Titanic Experience bottle from the Ender Node, and I think that sells for some really good money. I could splash it for experience, but I don't think that's even worth it. It's probably best if I just sell it, honestly. There we go, finally. So, I've, it took me like... I think half an hour, but I finally got an Ender Gauntlet, so that's another piece of the End Armor. So now my Void Sword is 120 strength, and that's probably going to be really useful, you know? We also have another Ender Node right there. We might as well just mine it and kill those dumb Ender Mites right there. We also got, like, a lot of, like, End Stone collection. I I'm almost at the Catalyst, bro. Like, that's how much End Stone I've been getting. And Obsidian and I went pretty far with that as well, you know. So yeah, we're at 1.4 mil. But here's what we're gonna do. So we have this Enderman pet, and it makes the transmission abilities deal more damage. So we're gonna go ahead and buy an aspect of the end. Um, I don't know if they're expensive or not. Hopefully they're not too expensive. Okay, 300k, I can get one. So now I have an aspect of the end, and I can use it to like teleport around and all that. So I probably could give it a reforge for mana just because it needs one so we're gonna go for heroic there you go second try perfect so yeah now it's gonna give a mana so i can like teleport more with it and then it even makes me move faster for a little bit as well so that's gonna be perfect for us tenant ball yeah 500k that's some good oh it already filled <laughs> all right well i guess i'll take that money then all right so we finally got the gauntlet piece after what felt like forever i think we're gonna go ahead and eat another jerry candy and then we have a dungeon potion okay we're out of strength potions but i think it'll be all right right there's some corrupted enderman right there i don't know what was up with that but it's whatever i guess i got something called sulfur <laughs> i don't know if i was supposed to unlock that but these endermen are crazy strong so you probably shouldn't bother them right Corrupted fragment spreads fast. Interesting. I don't think those are any good though. So we can go inside here where this guy is the dragon ritualist and his name is Taizo. So yeah, we can you can use dragon essence and then we can get like some like really interesting perks. One punch, recharge, rageborn, Z luck, ender training. Those are some really good perks, but like what we could do is just sacrifice like all the pieces we got and then just get some dragon essence, right? So let's go ahead and sacrifice pretty much everything we got real quick. All right, so I sacrificed everything and now I have 27 dragon essence. That's not enough for anything in here, but like it's all right. We can like eventually like start to like afford some things in here, right? 
Then we have the ZLR Bruiser Hideout, which requires Combat Skill 20, and I'm still at 15, so I don't know how I'm gonna get that. So how much damage are we gonna do? Okay, we're still doing only 10k, but if we teleport, we can one-tap these guys. It does 14k, so that's really good. We just gotta, like, teleport around, and then we can, like, just run around and then just one-shot these creatures, right? Gotta keep remembering to teleport. I need to kill these guys so I don't die. I'm gonna stop to enchant my ender pearls real quick. I'm getting a crap ton of beast area from this. I just unlocked a skeleton hat. Oh, okay, so it's not really anything good though, but it says your areas can explode on impact, so that's probably funny. There we go. I think there's an end snow protector. I think it might be nope. over here. Oh wait, and Star Protector already died. People did 20 million damage, what in the world? Just got combat 16. I think that might be enough for dragon armor. If we can get dragon armor, that would be really good. Honestly. Probably go for combat 18 for Aspect of the Dragons though. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the experimentation table. Because I forgot that I need to do it. So yeah, we can get some stuff from here. Or at least we can try to. Well, I got some decent stuff at least, I guess. That wasn't enough to level up my enchanting though, unfortunately. I need 200,000. And I only got uh, 123,000. There's something called refrigerate enchantment. I don't know what refrigerate is. But like, it seems funny. So yeah, I decided to brew myself some more... Strength potions, but the enchanted redstone for some reason isn't seeming to work. All right, so there we go, strength five, and I also got alchemy level fourteen. So yeah, I'm not skybox level twenty six yet. We're gonna try to get it, but now we got some more potions. So yeah, these are strength five potions. The dungeon potion already gives strength three. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I'm gonna need to buy my dungeon potions as well. So strength our strength five. So yeah, as I was saying, you'd have to like subtract like the strength from like the strength five. I mean, from the strength from the dungeon person to the strength of strength five, and then you'll like get like the actual amount if you know what I mean. So like my strength only went up by twenty two and not forty two, because the dungeon potion already gave some, which is still not bad. You know, it's not enough to one tap the Z loss unfortunately, but like at least it's like one tap in the Watchers I think, and that's what we're gonna at least need to do. Oh, someone's summoning a dragon, but I don't have a bow. It's not gonna be good. Alright, someone summoned a dragon. So I think there's a guy that sells bow up here. But first, I'm gonna put my... Okay, I don't have any room for my potions, so... The dragon might just die instantly, though. Because, <laughs> like, that has happened where the dragon has died instantly. Okay, the dragon already died. That was quick. Alright, so like, the episode's still going, and I haven't even gotten a single Ender Piece or Summoning Eye, so... We're gonna end the episode as long as we get just one of these things. So like, if I get like, a Summoning Eye, or if we get like, an Ender Belt or something from like, a Watcher... Then we can end off the episode. But like, until we get like, at least one of those things, or the episode's just gonna keep going. And hopefully this doesn't take hours, because I am not... Just gonna sit here for hours upon hours, and I got other things I need to do. So, yeah. Why well, didn't switch lobbies? I didn't want to go in one that, like, through summoning dragons yet, because I didn't really have any good bows to use, or really any bow at all. So, yeah. I got some more strength from Z Lot, so are you able to one tap them? Okay, no, they'll survive with, like, 3 HP. That's, like, Almost nothing. I mean, I'd say I could basically one-tap them. But I got a Golden Jerry, so... We're gonna kill him. And Golden Jerry is cool and all, but that was not my goal. Yes! Ender Cloak. Alright, so... We finally got the Ender piece. So yeah, I was Ender Cloak. I think the Obsidian Defenders dropped the belt. But like, now we do... Enough to literally just run up to a Z-Lot and just one-tap it now. Since this thing is 140 strength, like, that strength, it makes a pretty big difference, I'd say, right? We also got more health and defense as well, because, I mean, it gives 
a good amount of health and defense. See, I wasn't able to fit all my potions in my potion bag, so I just kept them laying in my inventory. But honestly, this episode has been going on for long enough, so I'm just not going to keep going. I do just have a critical six books in there, though. I don't know what I'd use that for. So yeah, we are back at two ma mil now, which is pretty good. If we were to sell our, like, golden dairy boxes, like, right now, we'd probably be at, like, four mil, maybe. And, like, all our other dairy boxes. So yeah, with that, I'm going to go ahead and end off the episode here. So please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and peace out.